Hey guys, I'm Oscar from Down Under and I want to share with you how I was able to spend a free night in a 5 star hotel. To tell you a little bit of a background, I flew from Melbourne to Sydney on the 4th of September to attend my partner's sister's wedding. <laughs> I booked a return ticket on the 9th of September. Due to strong winds and unforeseen circumstances, my flight got cancelled and I had to stay for another night. Good thing I used my American Express Explorer card which gave me travel insurance in cases of delay or inconveniences and as soon as I learned that my flight was cancelled, I called American Express customer service to confirm that I was indeed covered for what happened. I was covered to up to $500 in accommodations, meals and refreshments. So what I did was I went out, had a $20 dinner, uh, I think I bought $20 worth of beer and soft drinks, I'm not sure and I booked a hotel stay in Sheraton Grand Sydney for $300. So I stayed the night in this huge room all to myself and I asked my partner to come in early the next day because the room that I had bought had a complimentary breakfast for two people. Sheraton Grand Sydney has one of the best breakfast buffets in a hotel that I've experienced. Well, mainly because it's free. In total, I got about $340, essentially for free, just because my trip got cancelled and I was inconvenienced. You might be asking, huh, this sounds too good to be true, they're just gonna give you a free hotel stay like that? Well, let me tell you something, it's not. To hold this card, you're gonna have to pay $395 in annual fees. But let me tell you something, that $395 in annual fees will give you a lot more than what you're paying for. Starting off, having that $395 in annual fees will give you $400 in travel credit per year, offsetting the $395 instantly. And this $400 travel credit is something that you can use for flights, uh, hotel stays, car hires, and experiences. These experiences are loosely defined. As you can see from the American Express website, it could range from a day tour, a day walking tour, to snowboarding somewhere in the mountains. This perk alone has already paid for your $395 in annual fees plus $5 extra. If you're someone who travels constantly every year, I think this is one card that you could consider. Not only that, you'll also get two annual complimentary lounge passes in Melbourne and Sydney Airport's American Express Lounge, which individually would cost you $55 to have access to if you're a non-member. In the lounge, you can enjoy a three-hour stay before your flight with complimentary Wi-Fi, uh, buffet, free-flowing drinks, whatever is available that day and uh, a lot of uh, fruits and desserts. Let me tell you something, I've tried the lounge once and it's a lot better than waiting on the gate. If you'd rather use your travel credit for hotel stays, then this card will also give you up to 100 US dollars in hotel credit in selected hotels in Australia. That will give us a total of $660 in benefits every year, uh, offsetting your $395 in annual fees. But wait, there's more! You'd also be getting a myriad of travel insurances which could cover you for different amounts in different circumstances. Going back to my story earlier, this is why I got a free hotel stay in Sheraton Grand Sydney. I booked a hotel stay as soon as my flight was cancelled and I, uh, I was fortunate enough to use my American Express Explorer card which gave me that automatic travel insurance that I needed. So if you're 18 years old and above, a citizen or resident of Australia, and you're earning more than $65,000 in annual income, you're gonna be eligible to apply for the American Express Explorer card. But wait, there's more! If you apply now, get approved, and successfully complete all of the requirements, you will receive a sign-up bonus of 50,000 points. In the spirit of transparency, I'm gonna put my referral link down below, and if you use it to apply, I'll be getting 40,000 bonus points. But instead of you getting 50,000, you'll be getting 60,000 instead. But wait! There's more! Um, 
What else do I have for you? But wait! There's more! Um, I got... no. Nothing. I don't have an... But wait! There's more! Alright guys, there it is. All but wait! There's more! I'll start from down under and I'll see you in the next... But wait! There's more!